All right, so it is that time of the year again where we all fall for incredibly dumb jokes. And I'm gonna be honest, man, I really thought that this was a joke because obviously we just got the Easter update and I really wasn't expecting to receive another update, especially not on a Monday. But yet here we are celebrating April Fools with a very, very tiny update that I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys. Because honestly, some of you, especially the traders, might actually be interested in this and don't wanna miss out on it because you only have 24 hours to really do this. As I'm sure many of you know, the bundles are kind of like the hot trading thing that a lot of people do. Most of these bundles sell really, really well because of obviously the pets that are attached to it. Not only are they limited, but they also hold a lot of value. Now, since the game released, we've had a bunch of different bundles and they've all been limited, but for the most part, they've been around for about a week, sometimes even two weeks. If I go ahead and scroll up here, you guys will notice that there is now a brand new bundle which will only be in the game for 18 more hours as I'm recording this video. And this one is simply called Bwundle. Honestly, that sounded terrible saying it, but it had to be done. And I'm going to be honest, man, I've never purchased any of these bundles, except for maybe one of these lucky bundles, because I was going to do a video on the prismatic brush. Little did I know that I would end up with like 60 plus brushes in the future. But for the sake of the video, I went ahead and bought the Bwundle. And honestly, I purchased it very early on. I mean, it was literally minutes after the update dropped and I got number 925. So I think this pretty much confirms that Isaac is 100% driving a Lambo. But anyways, if we take a look at this pet, it does all three of the different stats that a lot of the newer pets have being coins, tokens, as well as damage. But obviously, like every single one of the other bundle pets, it's not going to have the best stats in the world. Going back to what I was saying at the start of the video, this is more of like a collector's thing or somebody that trades a lot. Now in game, he actually looks really sick. Like I kind of wish that I could add this to my team. So I'm definitely going to be adding this to maybe like a fishing team or a shrine team or something because honestly dude this thing is sick but now to my free-to-play players out there you guys are probably extremely upset because obviously this is only for people that have 999 robux willing to spare and it's just not good content well to those of you i have to say there actually is content for you now, just like the bundle, this is really nothing too crazy. It is a code that's going to give you a pet. So go ahead and type in looks max, which I'm going to be honest, I have no idea what that means. And I may have just said something really bad. Hopefully I didn't. Please enlighten me in the comments on where this is from, because obviously I am completely lost. Either way, once you enter that code, you will be given the Moggy pet. This little interesting guy right over here. I don't, I don't even know what to say. Like, obviously I know it's the dog model with just like a human face on it and blue eyes, but it kind of looks like a piece of toast with a face on it and ears. I don't know why I can't unsee that, but yet when I look at the doggy over here, I don't see the toast. Is it just me or am I, am I cooked right now? Either way, man, one thing that I do want to do in this video, that's going to make a lot of the traders out there, especially the collectors, cringe right now because i am fully aware of how much people are extremely disappointed about this but i mean technically now that i'm thinking about it maybe you guys won't be too upset with this because we do have like void cherries to kind of take away the shiny so technically uh, maybe you guys won't be bothered by this either way i'm gonna go ahead and turn both of these shiny just so we can get a general idea and see which one we like because i'm obviously gonna be using these either for fishing or for a shrine so it's really not gonna be too important whether it's shiny or not so i'm just gonna base this purely on the color currently i have 760 cherries i have no idea how long this is gonna take me or it's gonna click until shiny and see what happens okay i mean it was about a good i don't know like 20 or so turns it completely black and wait hold on what did that change the name of the pet guys i think it actually changed the name of the pet now it's called the one the woman the woman is the it don't want the wominous. That makes sense. Now let's see what happens over here with the Moggy. I'm not going to lie. I'm a little afraid of turning both of these pets shiny. I feel like, obviously, we already did the pay to win one. That one was okay. But what if this one ends up being like the one that's just not supposed to ever be turned shiny and instead it's just supposed to consume all of your cherries? Dude, this would be really heartbreaking. I'm not going to lie. 732. What's going to happen? Oh my bro. I actually thought it was going to consume all of them. That almost took 100. All right, so it looks like the Moggy, when you turn it into shiny, it doesn't change its name. But this one, 
I'm pretty sure that it changed its name. I might be going crazy. Somebody go ahead and rewind and let me know in the chat. Either way, man, for the most part, that is the entire update. It was something very small, super unexpected, but I guess kind of cool. I mean, we can't really complain. We just got an update a couple of days ago. Originally, this was not going to be my video for today. I was actually going to do a showcase on all of the new limiteds, as well as show you guys the trophy from Arcade, because I know that that's something that a lot of people want to see. I've been reading your DMs. I'm definitely going to get to the showcase. I promise. It's just that because it's been Easter weekend, it's been, you know, more chilled, more laid back, but we're back on the ground. Ryan. so more than likely be expecting the showcase video or should i say the trophy video tomorrow but before we go ahead and end this i do want to go ahead and do one quick thing originally when i got the hyper board in rainbow i wasn't able to go ahead and make a video on it there was just too many things going on for me to squeeze this into a video but because today's video is a shorter one i'm gonna go ahead and squeeze in something that i've been working on for the last couple of days now which is getting a rainbow comet board I finally have enough to go ahead and turn it. So just to kind of explain to you guys how this process works, you basically need to get your hands on one of every single color of whatever specific mount. The colors being blue, green, orange, purple, red, and yellow. The base one doesn't count. Once you have all of them, you just come to the rainbow five machine, click on the board. It's going to show you all of the ones that are required over here on the right. And then just hit convert and you've got yourself a rainbow. This one is actually really, really cool. I still kind of prefer the hyper board a little bit more but i mean this one is still great regardless next mount that i need to go for is a rainbow pool ball then at that point we will have every single one of the boss mounts in rainbow and we can start chasing after some of the other ones that are definitely going to be a lot more complicated either way man like i said before keep an eye out for tomorrow's video it's going to be good we got a lot of things to talk about in that video especially regarding the trophy pet so don't miss it turn on those notifications subscribe to the channel if you have not already drop a like on this video if you enjoyed it but that's going to do it for this one like always i will see you guys in the next one have a great april fools and i hope you had a great easter Take care.